Hello, this is Shannon from Retro Dolls US. Uh, today I'm going to be talking about specialty types of hair that you can use for customizing dolls and ponies and other types of action figures and toys, whatever. Um, the first I will show you is our fizz hair. Um, this is a saran with uh, tinsel added to it. It is um, an iridescent wavy tinsel um, which we do sell separately as you can see it's got those little kinks in it um, you can boil perm this you can boil perm saran um, it's a little bit more um, of a process uh, to do saran um, polypropylene conecalon um, and monofiber to to boil perm them. What you want to do is you put them in the in the um, straws or curling rods, and then you dip them in the boiling water for about five seconds. If you pour it over the heads, um, you want to do it for about ten seconds, and then you immediately dip in ice water. Um, that's called blanching, and what it does is it sets the hair longer. You want to do this a total of three times. Um, repeat process ending uh, with a cold hair or cold water and then you set for 24 hours overnight to dry um, you can leave it in longer than that as well um, as you can see I'm in the middle of making a custom and uh, what I did was I twirled the hair and stuck it uh, stuck um, dress pins in there so there's different types of styles you can do with all types of hair um, now the next I'll show you is our Saran um, Thermal. This is called Moonbeam. Um, oh, back to back to the um, this the fizz. Um, if you look on our sites, you'll see there's two different types of hair that's mi mixed with tinsel: um, a fizz and twinkle. The twinkle is the polypropylene. The fizz is the Saran. Um, just so you know. Um, this is Moonbeam Saran uh, Thermal, and what you do is you'll notice that when you apply heat, um, it, it will change color. As you can see, it goes from blue to a really pretty creamy white. Um, now the, the Saran will go back to its original color fairly quickly and easily once it cools down. Um, there are two other types, our polypropylene and our pilot. Um, they are a lot touchier than the saran, um, especially the pilot. It, you know, once it changes color, it tends to stay that way for a very long time, um, unless you were to stick it in the freezer or extreme cold. So you want to be aware of that before using it. Um, another type of specialty hair is glow in the dark, which you can see this is polypropylene. They also, there's also nylon available or out there, but none of the stores have it currently. Um, and eventually we are going to be getting some saran glow in the dark in different colors. Right now you can only get white glow in the dark. So that'll be nice because we'll get some pinks and greens, um, eventually uh, we're working on that so next up is two-toned hair this is a retired color um, as you can see one end is a light orange the other one's red um, to root this you would you can either root it like normal and just have a blend at the bottom or if you wanted to have only light to dark, you could do um, the knot method where you sew it in with a long needle and knot the ends. Um, so uh, now we'll go to the tinsel. Um, we have spiral tinsel. This is our rose spiral. Um, this is exclusive to the U.S. Retro Dolls US. Um, as you can see, it's really, uh, it has a lot of kinky 
waves in it. It is harder to work with. Um, this is a silk fiber, so you can boil permit um, now as opposed to our wavy, which is basically the same thing, only it is a little bit uh, nicer material, um, not as difficult to work with. Um, so we have the spiral and the wavy, but the spiral is um, exclusive to Retro Dolls US. Another exclusive hair we have is our laser, or to the US, is our laser tinsel. As you can see, um, the way the light hits it, it has a laser type effect, um, and it looks really pretty. This is our silver. Um, let's see here. This is in our clearance section. Well, this one is retired. I don't have that anymore, but it's, um, I might get some more in. This is, I believe, lime chiffon, and it is a synthetic, and you want to be careful with the synthetics here um, because it can melt in very high temperatures. Um, if you're unsure of a type of hair, a good way to remember is to always, if you switch bags or whatever, Always write down the name and the type of hair that comes on the label of the original bag. If you're unsure, you can always ask. Um, and if you, if you know nobody knows the name of it or type of it, just take a very small piece of it and test it um, in boiling water, just to make sure, because uh, you don't want to to root an entire doll or pony or whatever you're working on and and have it you know not be able to work like you want it to. Um, next one is our Marley hair. As you can see, it comes in a big hank like this. It um, looks like dreads. It is harder to work with. You just separate it. Um, and a very little bit goes very long ways. Um, this is what it looks like. Sorry, in a pony head, which the pony head got stained so I'm definitely I'm gonna have to take that out and paint put a base coat on the pony but this is how it looks you can separate it into little um, sections and dread it if you like uh, to dread it what you would do is you would back comb the hair in sections um, to back comb you take a fine tooth comb and instead of brushing it Towards the end of the hair, you would brush it down towards the head. It's like teasing the hair. And then you would stick it in boiling water, and that, that would cause the dread effect. Um, also in our clearance section is Kinecolon. There Now, there are very many types of, uh, very many, ha, huh? um, a lot of types of Kinecolon out there. Um, this is, you can see, it's like the real floofy kind. It's... Um, very soft it's crimped um, it would make excellent like 80s type hair or mermaid hair um, or dreads this is uh, the type of Kinecolon that is often used in dreads um, and this is our peacock which is in our clearance section um, now there is another type of Kinecolon actually two other types of Kinecolon I'll show you in the next video um, talking about our regular types of hair but um, just have a few more types of specialty hairs that I will show you and then we will stop this video because we're already at nine minutes and we will start the uh, the second version of the video now this is a weft um, this is I don't have it at the US store but you can find it at the UK store and as you can see, the tips are dyed pink, dip dyed. Um, and this is really nice for like ball jointed dolls and things. If you were to make a wig um, for your dolls, this a lot of people use wefted hair. Um, but if you want to use it for your custom ponies or to use a rooting tool, all you have to do is clip off the ends here and just... Um, bend it in half and have it's it's really like our two-toned hair um so all you have to do is is do like you would for that 
And then we have our curly synthetic hair, which is absolutely gorgeous. This is our navy blue curly hair and a little bit goes a very long way. Um, and what you do is you just separate that into little, little sections and root it. Um, almost done. We also have, this is our fleece hair. It is hand dyed. This is fire sky. I have one of these left. It's staple length is 10 inches long. Um, it's red with like a purpley black tips. It was dyed by Barbed Dragon, who does wonderful customs. And um, this is half an ounce, and this will, like, seriously, it, it can do a couple ponies or, you know, one or two dolls. Um, and we also have mohair that is, we have white and black, like the original colors, and then we have some hand dyed ones. Um, and they come in shorter staples and super soft. Um, and then this is Firestar Nylon, which is uh, a lot of people use for roving. Um, for, for um, gosh, I'm sorry. My brain's like fried tonight. Um, a lot of people use it for uh, crocheting, for yarns and projects like that. But you can take this it comes in like one long one long hank um, this is an ounce and it will break off into smaller it breaks off very easily so you're gonna have shorter pieces of hair but it's very soft it's like mohair and um, there's other types you can get like bamboo silk uh, tussa silk, viscose, and you can use yarn for hair, um, frayed ribbons. It, I mean, you can get really creative with your with what you use for for hair. So um, this is all our specialty types of hair. We have many different colors, um, many different styles, and it's at www.retrodollsus.com. And if you have any questions, uh, please feel free to post below or shoot me an email. Um, find me on Facebook or Instagram. Uh, and I will be back.